On absentee and mail-in voting uh, happening right now, some people are confused by the difference. Local 5's Eric Richards uh, dove into this issue with a local expert, gives us a breakdown. Things are heating up as we get closer to Election Day on November 3rd. There is a lot of focus on the United States Postal Service and absentee ballot casting. So what is the difference between mail-in ballots and absentee ballots? Celestine Jeffries breaks it down. The state of Wisconsin, when you're voting by mail, you're voting absentee, so they are one and the same. And if you vote early in person absentee, uh, essentially what you're doing is you're casting an absentee ballot, but at an early in-person site and for the city of Green Bay right now, that's the clerk's office here at City Hall. Here in Green Bay, you can request an absentee ballot from the city clerk's office. When you get it, you can fill it out and submit it to any U.S. Postal Service location or come here to City Hall and place it in a secure lockbox that you see behind me. Over the last several weeks, customers say that they've experienced extensive delays at the post office. In response, USPS has stated, Congress created this problem in the beginning, and Congress can fix it. President Trump had this to say. Absentee ballots are great. They've worked for a long time, and I, I totally endorse absentee ballots. Back here at home, you can visit myvote.wi.gov for more information on absentee voting. In Green Bay, Eric Richards, Local 5 News. And on Tuesday, there will be a voter registration event at the old Associated Bank building at the corner of Monroe and Cherry if you would like to vote in the November elections.